Uh, hey, my name is Kuba. I'm one of the coaches in our lovely team, Dragons Crack of FC. Oh, hey, my name is Kuba. I'm one of the coaches in our lovely team, Dragons FC. Uh, I joined the club uh, mostly because of one of my friends who's playing right now in Dragons, uh, Michal. We're playing together in uh, one team in the north of Krakow. Uh, I met the guys uh, because of Michal. I talked to them, tried if I can uh, go for a try, and that's how I started my uh, adventure uh, as a player. I had enough of uh, injuries, but I didn't want to leave the club because of the people, because of the project, because of the atmosphere. So I wanted to stay close to the, to the team, to the colleagues, and that's why we decided I can get a try as a coach. Then I started my license, and that's how it goes right now. mainly the license <laughs> uh, but the other thing is I think some kind of uh, experience with the lower Polish leagues because it's it is something something special uh, how usually the teams we are playing against are playing uh, how to behave I don't know with the refs with the atmosphere around the teams like Beklasa that's the first thing mm, I don't know maybe there's something different because I was them like half a year ago. I was also the player and right now I'm the coach. So maybe it's easier to connect from the coaches to the players through the one person. And I think what I wanted to implement in our team more uh, was discipline about being on time, behaving on the training, uh, like doing your job done during these two hours. And after that, I think everyone in the team knows that I'm the first one to have fun. But during the training, during the game, let's just focus, be serious and do our job. I think it helped that I played in different teams. Some of the exercises I implemented as I remember what I did and what was good for me as a player. Uh, of course, during the UFAC course, we had a lot of exercises shown, presented and uh, Rewrite and how to do it to make it work. What I'm planning to do this uh, before this round, I think mostly the same. And I expect that the players will just do it better. A few people already asked if we are doing something like that, if we will do something more because they felt it was good for them. They felt that their body are ready to play. I think uh, this round again I'll focus about the fitness trainings just before the league starts. We have a little bit of democracy there, we just talk, uh, giving uh, each other's ideas to help the team win the games. Mm, about this particular team, uh, it gives you a lot of uh, joy to do it, um, because I always wanted to be involved in any way in sports, but I don't think I'll treat it as my career path because I got my normal job. Right now I'm like feeling I want to help my friends because all of the team members, coaching staff were my friends, are my friends, I hope. Uh, so I want to help as much as I can. During my internship, I got the opportunity to train with the little kids and oh, it's you can feel the satisfaction after the training when the you know five, six, seven year olds are looking at you like you're the hero and the joy that they have by just playing the ball. It looks like total mess on the pitch, but the amount of joy you see in their eyes is priceless. And I think it is a good idea to, to train with the kids also, but maybe later. I I think uh, it was a little bit easier uh, to participate in this course because I was the player and I played in few teams. I had uh, a lot of coaches, some of them are really great people like as a coach and as a, as a person. Uh, I, I'm really thankful to them. Uh, and what it gave me as a future coach, like I said, uh, for sure a lot of theoretical knowledge 
but mainly the practical parts. When you had the trainings with the licensed co coaches with a lot of experience, uh, they showed you the exercises you can do, they showed you how to organize the group, how to give them a little bit discipline. Mostly I'm doing the same, but it helped a lot to organize the training from the start to the to, till the end. Like we're starting with one exercise, uh, like smoothly going to the other, so we don't waste time. We don't let players to you know warm up, stay, wait, getting cold because your muscles are working differently then. Uh, so I think it helped a lot of uh, with organizing the whole training from the very end, from the very beginning till the very end. I think it was almost perfect because uh, they told us that on UFRC when you'll say something went perfect you should end your adventure with the coaching because you should never be really really happy with what, what you did because always you can do something better and we still can do something better. Uh, the results are showing we couldn't do anything better but uh, about the how we played, how we managed some games, uh, about the motivation to some games, it can be better mm, and I think and hope we'll do the same uh, in the next round, that uh, we'll work hard in our preseason, we'll work hard during the, the season and we'll get motivated uh, all before every game. Like like Hugo is saying, every game is a, is a new game, like we shouldn't think anything about the previous games, if we won all the games, we should just focus on the, on the next game, that's the most important part. I think I'm happy with the things how it's how it, how it's going on right now. Uh, everything will depend about the preseason, about the the nearest uh, round from the players. If they'll come, they'll train hard like they did. I think I will be happy with everything almost. So it's all on you guys. I think all the games will be tough. To be honest, like um, of course the teams that are in the top of the table usually play better football, uh, but you can lose every game and you can win every game. It showed us like we played with the bottom teams and we struggled. Like like it, it wasn't that easy as you could you could uh, think about looking at just the table. So no, I won't say if we have tough games, easy games against uh, Tohovianka. I think it will be tough. But I think it will be tough for them because what players are thinking about this particular game already from the first 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 game we had. I think it will be just a lot of physical game, not not football as as football playing, but it will be like a little, really really physical game. I think yeah, I think a lot of teams get motivated more to play us because we're something different in the league. Uh, we get our results and I think most of the teams will have just one game this round and it will be a game against us. They will get motivated as much as they can just to show us that we're not the best. It will be fun. Uh, guys, get prepared for the preseason, that's for sure. Uh, it won't be easy. Uh, and to the, to the, I don't know, the fans, can we say, can we talk to the fans? It sounds weird in the class. Uh, we hope we can do everything we can to keep our uh, games, to keep our uh, table position till the end of the season. We can have a lot of fun uh, after the last game uh, of this season, then work even harder in, in higher league. I think that's it. Thank you a lot. <laughs>